My name is Arif Iqbal, and this is WNS News. In today's international segment, reports of hardship have emerged from Alaska. According to the Incorporated Press, corn harvests have dropped by 80% from last year's yields, the result of catastrophically heavy rains and floods plaguing the region. Local authorities are under obligation to provide nearly 80 million bushels of their crop to Biotechnica, the engineers behind the frost corn hybrid species. The city of Juneau now faces a difficult choice of whether to honor the agreement causing severe shortages in Alaska or break the contract and forego next year's seed corn delivery from Biotechnica. Whether you believe Alaskans deserve humanitarian aid or perhaps a lesson in self-reliance, Cast your vote at the address below. Freak accident or targeted attack? Nano bees terrorize the residents of Milan. Eyewitness accounts tell us 7 million of the Fengwang nanobots suddenly ceased their pollination functions and buzzed straight for the Lombardy capital, though the cause remains unknown. The nano bees infested several buildings and moving vehicles, causing numerous reported accidents. The mayor of Milan, Lorenzo Ricci, announced the formation of an investigative committee to determine the cause behind the bizarre phenomenon. Ever dreamed of being a head of state? Now may be your chance. Luxury real estate firm No Limits At All has announced another 15 artificial islands, available for sale now. Each island spans at least three square miles and possesses a foundation built to withstand an eight on the Richter scale. Because they are located in international waters, Island owners fall under no nation's jurisdiction and are free to establish and enforce local law and custom. For more information on your future slice of paradise, visit the address below. In the meantime, this lovely West Coast weather isn't a bad substitute. Thanks for tuning in, Night City.